Avalanche hosting the Coyotes, and the Coyotes are plus 330 on the money line. The Avalanche are minus 420. The over-under is 6.5 goals. The Coyotes getting a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 140, and the Coyotes getting 2.5 goals are minus 125 on the puck line. There's a couple of these games tomorrow. The Coyotes have won their last two games. Now, the Avalanche laying a goal and a half are minus 155 on the puck line, meaning if you bet them that way, they'd have to win by two. And the Avalanche laying two and a half goals, meaning if you bet them that way, they'd have to win by three, are plus 100. The Avalanche lost the last game that they played. Now, before you bet on this game, understand that these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop. And the Coyotes have been an excellent underdog when they're north of 300 like they are here tonight. Now, Use a site like VegasInsider.com. It'll allow you to compare all the casinos pricings in one place. And then go to a website like Covers.com. It'll allow you to compare how these teams have done individually, head-to-head against the spread, over-unders, money lines, so on and so forth. Head-to-head, the home team is 7-3. and three. The Coyotes are on a three-game winning streak against the Avalanche. The Avalanche are 6-4 and four against the Coyotes in their last 10. The underdog has won the last three games. The favorite is 6-4 and four on the money line. The underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 6-4. and four. There have been five one-goal games in their last 10, including two out of the last three. The over is 6-4, and four, but the under 6.5 goals is 6-4. and four. The last game that they played, the Coyotes won 6-3. to three. The game before that, the Coyotes won 2-1. to one. Both of those games were in Arizona. The game before that, the Coyotes won 3-2 to two in a shootout in Colorado. And the game before that, the Avalanche blanked the Coyotes 5 to nothing. Now, in their last handful of games overall, the Coyotes are 4-6 and six in their last 10. And the over is 6-3-1 and one in their last 10 games. We've had 5 goals, 8 goals, 9 goals, and 7 goals. The Coyotes have scored at least 4 goals in every one of their last 3 games that they've played. They only scored 1 in one of those games. Now, the Avalanche are 6-4 in their last 10 the under is 5-4-1 and one in their last 10 games. We've had 7 goals, 6 goals, 5 goals, and 10 goals. The Avalanche have scored 2-plus goals in every one of their last 10 games that they've played. Now, this is going to be one of those strange ones where people are probably going to look at me crazy, but there's value, and the Coyotes play the Avalanche very well. I'm going to take the Coyotes with the money line. I'm going to take the Coyotes getting the goals. And I am going to go over in this game because seemingly the Coyotes are scoring a bunch. I understand that the Avalanche are a better team than some of these teams that they've been playing. But I think if they're going to win, it's probably going to be a high-scoring game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.